Also looking at some showers and storms just to the north. It's dry in Tulsa, so it's a nice quiet start for us here. But uh, as you take a quick look up to the north there near Independence, moving into Parsons, now making its way on in to parts of southwestern Missouri, we are dealing with some showers and storms and even some severe thunderstorms there. There's still a watch that's in, uh, in effect for the far northern counties here of the viewing area as you make your way up towards Bartlesville. It's affecting Craig, Osage, Awada, Washington counties. However, uh, it's uh, a little unlikely that we'll see these showers and storms make their way that far south, but we could. Again, most of them just up into the uh, portions of southern Kansas now. Uh, future track is picking up on just a few very light showers there towards Tulsa by maybe 9 a.m. Otherwise, I think we're going to be nice and dry. Showers again remaining to the north and northeast. Lots of sun expected for us today, which again means it's going to heat up. We're starting the uh, day off at 82 degrees. Winds are out of the south at 14 miles an hour. Upper 70s, low 80s out there this morning, 82 in Tulsa, 77 Tahlequah. Uh, and today we have that excessive heat warning that's in effect again, uh, like yesterday. It starts at noon, goes until 8 o'clock. It includes Tulsa County, those heat indices anywhere from 110 to 113. And then the heat advisory for the rest of green country. It's that peach color you see there. That's from noon until 8 as well. Heat indices 105 to 110. Highs today will get up to about 98. We're looking for 99 tomorrow. Lots of sun continuing through Thursday. Friday night into Saturday, chance for showers and storms. And again, Saturday night into Sunday. Let's look outside on our Storm Shield traffic map.